firststepreading.com and this is Ellie from firststepreading.com and today is May 19th and let's do the calendar together. Let's start with the months. We have 12 months in a year. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Those are our 12 months of the year. Okay, Haley, what month is it? What month is it? Right here. Monday. Nope. Mm. May. May. Mm. And A-Y says A, so mm, May. Okay, let's figure out what day is it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Nineteen. Now we have to figure out which color nineteen. It's an A B pattern. It goes black red. So black. Black, red, 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 black. It was right. It's black. That's our A, B pattern. Okay, so our number up today is 19. To write a 19, oh, I need a piece of tape. To write a 19, we need a 1 and a 9. See, it's kind of like writing an A and then you write a, lot, a lowercase a and then you write a line all the way down. Our number of today is 19. What's going to be our number tomorrow? What's after 19? Hmm. What comes after 19? Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. It's going to be 20. What, came, what number came before 19? What's the number before 19? 18. Right. 18 comes before 19, and 20 will come after 19. Okay, our letter of today, our letter yesterday was F. So A, B, C, D, E, F. What comes next? G. G. We have our uppercase G and our lowercase G. And they both make what sound? What sound does a G make? G. 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 Can you tell me a word that starts with G? G. 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 Glamp. Yep, glamp. Glamping. Glamping. <laughs> or girl. G girl or g, g goat. All start with the letter G. Okay, you want to go look out the window and see the weather? <laughs> Haley's going to check the weather. I'm going to go over the season. There's four seasons in the year. There's summer, where it's hot, and you can go swimming, or play with water in a water table, or, and then there's fall, where it starts to get cold, and leaves fall off the trees, and they're changing colors. And then there's winter, where you might see some snow, and it's very cold. And spring comes after winter, where there's rain. Okay. Haley's found out the weather. Uh, and there's spring, it comes after winter, where there's flowers blooming, and you might see baby animals, and there's rain. So there's summer, fall, winter, or spring. There's four seasons. What is our season, Haley? Cloudy and cool. You say the weather is cloudy and cool, but what is the season? Spring. Spring is the season. 
in most places of the world, it will also be spring. So most likely where you live, it will be spring. But the weather will be different. Here, it is cloudy and cool. Your choices are sunny. Is the sun shining? Snowy. It usually doesn't snow in the spring, but snowy. Rainy. It rains a lot in the spring. It might be rainy where you live. Or windy. Are the leaves swaying in the wind? Is it blowing? That's windy. Haley said it's cloudy because she can't see the sun. There's just clouds all in the sky. And she said it's cool, which means if she went outside, she would need a jacket, right, Haley? If it was cold, she might need a snowsuit on top of this outfit and a hat and mittens. If it was warm, she wouldn't need a jacket. She'd be fine. And if I it was like I saw the warm. Right. And if it was hot. She wouldn't even need pants under this, and she'd probably be hot in her dress because she'd want to go swimming, it's so hot. But it's cool and cloudy. She would need a jacket if she wanted to go outside, and the sky is full of clouds. That's where we live, but it's going to be different where you live, maybe. Let's go over the days of the week. Opposite. It could be opposite. It could be the same. Let's see. There's seven days in the week. You want to sing our song? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Those are our seven days of the week. Okay, I'm going to give everybody a hint. I'm going to change my hint for today. Tomorrow is Wednesday. Tomorrow is Wednesday, so what is today? If tomorrow is Wednesday, tomorrow is Wednesday, tomorrow is going to be that day. Tuesday, today must be Tuesday. And what day was it yesterday? What day was it yesterday? Yesterday was Monday. Today is Tuesday, yesterday was Monday, and tomorrow will be Wednesday. Do you want a graph? Yeah, 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 go on. Do you want a graph? Our weather report? So it's cool, cool, really? Cool and cloudy. That's cool. This one's cool. That one's cold, like winter. Cool oh. and cloudy. I can draw my ass in That's okay. You can print a new one. So if you want to graph your weather, you can also print that out on the website and you can graph the weather where you are and you could see um, which days the weather is mostly. Is it mostly cool? Is it mostly hot where you live? Is it mostly rainy? Oh my god, I changed because I forgot the other one. Okay, no problem. And let's go over our sight words. Sight words are also called memory words or popcorn words. These are words you must memorize. It's really helpful to remember these words because if you know them when you're reading and you know them by heart, you could read much faster and it will help you understand your story better. So these are our sight words that we're going over. I added the new ones. The new ones for today are she, she, will, and me. Here's all of them that we've learned so far. A, am, an, and, are, at, do, for, has, have, her, I, in, is, me, not, said, she, oh, watch out, Haley, they can't see, she, the, to, will, or with. Those are all the side words we've learned so far. That's a lot. If I were you, maybe write those down on flashcards and practice them at nighttime so you can remember them. Keep practicing it, and, and over time, you'll remember them when you see them. Haley, can you put your brush away? Okay. Thank you. Just please leave it there. Okay, you ready to be my helper? Haley, you want to be my helper with the sentence? Here, I'm going to read it and then you can circle. Okay. We're going over et, the et word family. 
doing? Meh. Like meh, right? Shh. She. She meh. S-H says shh. This word is she. It's one of our new sight words. She will. Two L's and it still says will. Like as if it was one L. It just says will. She will not let me set, set the woof, et, wet, et, pet, in the j, et, j. She will not let me set the wet pet in the jet. Okay, there's a lot of sight words today, Haley. Start with she. Can you circle she? Good job. Then circle will. And not. Me. Me. Good job. The. Good job, you found two thes. In, in, there's one more. In, in. That's a lot of say words. That's a lot of say words today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven say words in one sentence. How do we know it's one sentence? How do we know it's one sentence? It starts with a capital letter and it ends with a period. There's only one period, so we know it's only one sentence. Okay, good job. Let's do 